Okay, uh, inmates do not speak unless they are spoken to. Wait, there's been a mistake. My name is Jacob Lee. I'm not an inmate. You were inmate. 532-521. You address me as Captain Ferris. What? No, no, no. I'm just a cargo pilot. I was attacked by the outer way. By her. She crashed my ship and she killed my first officer. I don't care. Warden Zors. Oh, speak of the devil. Joyce. Alas, are you sure this is the right one? Hey, hey. Get me out of here! What are you doing here? What the hell is going on? Did you know it was her? Is this who we're looking for? Yeah, well, look, I just knew it was someone who could help us. And what? why would I help you? Well, look, I've been here forever. Well, I've got all the information on this place, and I can get us to the hangar. All right, and you, you can call down a shuttle, and, and he can fly it out. Look, we can do this. We just gotta stick together, all right? Thanks. I'll take my chances. A word of advice, though? Don't trust him. He's not what he seems. Alert. Him not to trust you. How did you find us? Emergency beacon. You're lucky I'm the one who picked it up. No, you're too late. Not for what I need. He knew Black Iron like the back of his hand. Hey, what are you doing? Hey! Now I do too. Hey, wait! Wait! Where do you think you're going? I'm a pilot! You need me! Hangers that way. Better start walking. Oh, come on! Uh, medical supplies? Bullshit. Open it. Why? Because I said so. And we're not going anywhere until you do. <laughs> okay, fine. <sighs> Yep, just like I told you. But records show you made multiple drops right before the incident. Yeah, me and a dozen other cargo ships. Don't try to talk your way out of this. I know you were involved. I had nothing to do with what happened on your own. What's wrong with you? Uh, this, this, this implant is messing with my head. This doesn't make any sense. But I'm gonna figure it out. In the meantime, you better pull it together. Someone's gonna fly us out of here. Come on, let's go. This is the place, right? Yeah, but I don't see the elevator. Shit, it's busted. I was hoping we'd get lucky, but this whole place is falling apart. Well, there's got to be another way down. Then let's find it. Come on. Danny. Danny. I won't go. You can't make me. You killed them all. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, stop it! Tried to protect you. You didn't deserve this. Danny. Hey, Danny. Get away from me! Okay. Okay, hey. I'm sorry. I'm okay. 
Be sure. You don't seem okay. I was in their mind. Reliving their memories. There was an outbreak. 75 years ago. Just like what's happening in the prison. They killed everyone. Trying to contain it. Everyone. Jake! What's wrong with you? Hey! Come on! Come on! I can't! On. Yes, you can! We're almost there! No! I can feel it! Uh, hear it in my head. Okay. You stay here. I'm gonna come back when I get the cure. Uh, I can take care of myself. Okay. Make him pay for what he's done. I want my sister back, fucker. <laughs> Valiant effort, but surely you know by now, I never lose. No, this time you do. <laughs> Such a waste. All this to save one life. Don't think you've stopped us. The data gathered here will carry the protocol to the next phase. Don't do this! No! Jacob! Jacob! Data transfer complete. That transfer worked both ways. He learned more about me, and I learned more about him. In the chaos of the moment, I didn't realize he had also given me the evidence I was looking for all along. And sacrificed his life so that I could expose the truth. Was he trying to make up for the pain he caused? Or just chasing some kind of redemption? Either way, I hope he found some peace.